Today's recipe is for all the lazy cooks out there. No need to knead, literally. I'm not going to knead a dough, but what I'm making is an egg paratha. How? Let's begin. Like I said, I'm going to make a batter to make a paratha. The first thing that I'm going to need in this recipe is a whole egg, followed with cold milk. Season this with salt, freshly cracked black pepper. To make this nice and herby, I'm going to add in freshly cut coriander leaves and finally refined flour. We're going to mix all of this together and make a lump-free batter. To adjust the consistency, you may add in, say, a few tablespoons of water. The whole idea is to make sure that this becomes like a flowing batter. Time to cook this. Let's heat a pan on high flame. And I'm going to pour in a ladle full of this batter in the pan. After cooking this on medium flame for say 30 to 40 seconds, we're going to carefully give this a flip. After this, a teaspoon of oil. This is regular vegetable oil. Cook this now like a paratha and we all know that. Our egg paratha is done and ready. Let's quickly make some more. Just to take this to the next level, what I'm doing is taking a whole egg in a bowl. To this, I'm adding in some chopped onions, some coriander leaves, a touch of salt, and with this, a touch of red chili powder. What am I making? A quick omelet. Let's add this mixture onto the egg paratha. And now what you have is a double egg paratha. One inside, one on top. Carefully, let's flip this and cook this till the egg is perfectly done. Let's transfer this onto a work surface and I'm going to convert this into a quick roll. Let's add in some chopped onions, some chopped green chilies for the adventurous ones, a little bit vinegar, a touch of red chilli powder and to get this extra tang in the recipe, a touch of amchur powder. With this, your double anda roll is done and ready. And here comes idea number three for all the ones from my gang, the sunny side gang. Let's quickly make a paratha just the way I showed you earlier. I'm going to top this up with an egg. Add in some onions, some chilies, some coriander, a touch of salt and a touch of red chilli powder. Let's cover this and allow this to cook precisely for a minute or till the egg is done to your choice. With this, your egg paratha is done and ready. And remember what I said, no need to knead. This is me, the Bombay Chef Varun Namdar, signing off. Make this for your friends, family, and impress them. Bye for now.